You are now watching Tales from the Grid. Since Beetleborgs aren't as popular as Power Rangers, I'd be willing to pay an additional $5 for these pins. I believe the prices for these figures were cheaper when they first came out, so I'd like to pay the old price. I would love if the rest of the Zords were made. Unfortunately, the White Tiger Zord was cancelled. I wonder what caused the orders to miss the minimum requirement. I hope the White Tiger Zord gets announced, because there's multiple versions of the Dino Megazord. I'd like to see at least the Rangers make an entry into this series. The Yellow and Black Ranger helmet should have already been released at this point. The pink and black power weapons should have already been released at this point. I would think that making a morpher for every ranger would be easy since it's essentially a color swap and a different engraving on the power coins. The Beetle Bonder can be one piece with different attachments for each Beetleborg. There's been a rumored presentation at which the Zap White Tiger Zord was shown, so I hope it's released this year. A remastered Armored Black Ranger should be easy to do since they already did it with the Red Ranger. I wouldn't be surprised if Beetleborg figures were sold at deluxe prices. Making an Armored Black Ranger shouldn't be hard since they made the Green Ranger. I would buy the entire wave of these mini fig pins. I would buy an Armored Black Ranger along with the entire wave of these Excel fig pins.
Making an armored black ranger shouldn't be hard since they made the green ranger. Falco's 4 inch pop pin seemed to be under marketed. Making an armored black ranger shouldn't be hard since they made the green ranger. It appears that this line is dedicated to real life music artists and athletes so the chances are slim to none for the rangers making it to this series. Making an armored black ranger shouldn't be hard since they made the green ranger. I would buy the entire wave of these pops if they were ever to be released. I would love if the rest of the zords were made. The beetleborgs would probably be a better fit at this size. The Dino Zords would probably be a better fit at this size. If they can make the Ultra Zord at this size, then they can definitely make the Dino Zords or Mega Zords at this size too. The Mega Zords would be a perfect fit for this line. They're Mega Zords. They're supposed to be Mega. I'm not paying $800 for a statue. You may get me for two or two fifty, but not eight hundred. Thank you for watching another episode of Tales from the Grid, and until next time, have a good one.